multifunction computerized household embroidery machine operation video. Part 1. Bobbin winding and installation. Power on. Install the bobbin on the fixed shaft. Put the roll line on the thread bar and cover it with roll line cover. Following the route 1 to 4 to threading. Crossover wire hook. Bypass the wire groove. Turn the thread around the shuttle. Push the shuttle to the right. Start the winding by pressing the start or stop key. When the winding is full of 80% to 90%, press the start or stop button again to stop the winding. Push the spool back to the left. Remove the shadow coil and cut the thread. Open the bottom thread transparent cover. Place the bottom thread counter clockwise in the direction shown on the machine. Cut the ends with a second cutter. Put on the bottom thread transparent cover. Part 2. Threading Power off. Turn the hand wheel and stop the needle at the upper level. Lift the presser foot. Put the roll line on the thread ball and cover it with roll line cover. Following the route 1 to 5 to threading. Cross over the wire hook and then go through the wire cover. Bypass the take-up lever. Threading through the needle. Put down the presser foot. Threading through an automatic threading device. Hang the thread on the hook and loosen the threading lever. The thread is pulled through the pinhole to form a 3 to 5 mm ring. Pull the thread out about 10 cm long. Lift the presser foot. Pull down to the rear of the machine. Part 3. Replace needle and presser foot. Replace presser foot. Power off. Press the spring switch on the presser foot holder. Let the presser foot down in free state. When installing, press the presser foot to the notch of the presser foot bracket. Put down the presser foot. Replace needle. Power off. Loosen the fastening screw with a screwdriver. Take out the needle. When installing, the needle should be backward and need to be pushed up to the top. Lock the screw tightly with a screwdriver. Part 4. Sewing Power on Select a stitch. Button 1. Straight same stitches. Reverse same stitches. 42 stitches. Button 2. Straight same stitches, 111 stitches. Button 3, button hole stitches, 7 stitches. Click the stitch type to select the required stitches. After the user selects the needle trace, click the mirror key in the screen and automatically flip the left and right direction of the needle. Click plus, minus can adjust width, length, and speed. Click the combination key. Different stitch can be combined operation. If we do, click the erase key to erase the selected stitch pattern and redo it select. After the stitch combination is completed, click the storage key to save. The location of the saved stitch is in the stitch custom category 4 inside. Double needle sewing. Install two needles correctly. Click on the single double needle switch. Switch to double stitching or the needle will be broken. The double needle cannot be threaded through a forced thread. Sewing stitch. Put the fabric on the presser foot. 
Click the confirmation key after the stitch selection is completed. Put down the presser foot. Click Start or Stop button to start sewing. Click Start or Stop button to stop sewing after finishing. Click the cord line. The machine automatically do thread trimmer. Ensure that the needle is lifted at the highest position and then remove the cloth to complete the sewing operation. Part 5. Button hole. Take out the presser foot in the right way. Put the button into button hole presser foot to make sure the button hole's length. Press the button hole presser foot to the notch of the presser foot bracket to complete the installation. Put cloth which is marked with button hole under the presser foot. Pull down the presser foot. Pull down lever. Select the button hole stitch. Click the confirmation key. Click start or stop button to start sewing. Finish and sewing. Click the cord line. The machine automatically do thread trimmer. Lift the presser foot and take out the fabric. Use the cutter to cut the button hole from the middle. Part 6. Embroidery Power off. Change the presser foot for embroidery operation only. Fix the screw. Take out the extension table. Insert the embroidery connection socket into machine. Take out embroidery frame. Install embroidery cloth. Put the embroidery cloth into embroidery frame. Fix the screw. Power on. Install the embroidery frame buckle correctly into the metal slot of the embroidery machine. Click built-in pattern edit key with 96 embroidery pattern inside. Click the hollow letter key A with 0 to 9 hollow numbers and 26 hollow letters. Click the flower letter key A with 26 letters in it. Click the U-Disc icon to select imported or the saved customized patterns. Click the number key A. There are three kinds of fonts. Each of them has a setting for uppercase and lowercase letters, 0 to 9 digits, punctuation and large, medium and small size. Click the pane on the right side with 10 different shapes options. Click the combination key. Different pattern, no number, or letter, or shape can be combined operation. Click built-in pattern edit key. Select the pattern. Click the edit key. Click flower frame switch key to switch the flower frame size. Adjust the position of the pattern by arrow. Click Rotate key. Rotate at 1 degree, 10 degrees, or 90 degrees. Click Zoom key. You can zoom in on the pattern. Click the mirror key. It will show pattern mirror. Click the simulation color key. It will show color page. Click the background key to select the background color. Click the embroidery color one or two separately. Select the thread color and turn it off to back to pattern edit interface. Click the end key to end into embroidery interface. 
Click the Frame key to preview the embroidery position and adjust the frame position by arrow. Click Thread Tension Adjustable button. The bigger the number, the bigger the tension. The smaller the number, and the smaller the tension. Pull down the presser fold. Click Start or Stop button to start sewing. After few stitches, click Start or Stop button and cut the thread. And then click Start or Stop button to continue the sewing. While sewing, press button plus, minus can adjust the speed. When stop sewing, change the thread according to the prompt. When the sewing is finished, click the car line, the machine automatically do thread trimmer. Lift the presser foot. Take out the embroidery frame to complete the embroidery operation. If the bottom thread runs out, after restore the bottom thread correctly, click Advance and Retreat key to adjust the needle numbers. The maximum adjust numbers can be reached to 100. If click Coil Select button, can end into next stitch color embroidery. Part 7 USB Input Attention! The input of the pattern size cannot be greater than 100 mm by 235 mm. Please use letters or 0 to 9 numbers for the name of pattern file. Pattern input. Insert the U disk into USB port. Power on. Enter the main interface, then click the set key. Click the pattern import. Click the pattern file that need to be imported. Then click the import key to import the pattern into the machine. After the import completes, click the back button to return to the main interface. Click USB icon to check all the imported pattern files. The user may import the files as needed delete operation. Part 8. Maintenance Power off. Open the cover. Take out the bobbin. Grab the needle plate B on both sides to move in its own direction. Take out needle plate B. Take out the inner kettle. Remove the dust on inner kettle, inner rotating shuttle, and outer kettle, outer rotating shuttle with brush. After cleaning, install the inner kettle in properly way. Roll the hand wheel to check if the machine is in good condition. Install bobbin. Install needle plate B. Cover the transparent bobbin cover. 